Today we're taking a look at a new anime game called Anime Burst dropping tomorrow. Let's take a quick look at the trailer. All right. Oh, Sungjin Woo. Dang, look at that. That's actually pretty sick. Gohan, Kaiju, Julius, Ukiora. Ichigo? Oh, man. This is looking great, guys. All right. Let's hop in the game. All right. So, looks like we have a thousand gems to start out with. So, let's check out some of the features they have. Okay. Battle Pass reminds me of quite a bit, a few games. Battle Passes. 500 gems from one tier is actually pretty good. Like, usually, like, you know, these games be giving you like 50. So, I'm freaking happy with that. So, it looks like the Battle Pass is pretty sweet. And there we go, guys. Tier 50 of the Battle Pass. Looks like you get Sung Jin Woo for free. And that is on the, I believe that's on the free side? Question mark. Not sure which side is free, but usually the top is free. Yeah, the top, the, yeah, it should be on the free side. And it looks like the paid side gets you some potions. Cool. All right, we also got some quests as well. So here we go, level quest, level one. Okay, it looks like we get a free reroll every level. Dang. Or at least for the first few levels. All right, complete all quests. Okay, looks like we got a lot of cool quests. The UI is looking pretty good. All right, trait rerolls looks cool. Good unit storage. I don't know why this is so small, but it looks good. Um, let's go head over to the awaken. Oh, wait, no. Oh, I hit the summon button. Duh. All right, here we go. So here is the summon. All right. So it looks like there is luck potions, <clears throat> but we're just gonna do a straight up 10x. So this should cost us a thousand gems. There is no discount for summoning 10. All right, so you click fast and it'll open them all up. So here we go, gray. Asta, Asta, okay, Gray, oh no, Kirito, um, Gray again, ooh, Sin Sanji, huh. it looks like the One Piece characters are um, uh, copyright protected, okay, all right, here we go, and we got Kilowatt as well, so uh, let's go equip all of these, now you want to have all of your slots filled because of the style of this game, so it looks like our best character is going to be Sinji, and they all have different like abilities. So we have attackers, we have um, uh, attackers with intellect, we have attackers with strengths, and we have attackers with agility. And there also looks like there's defenders as well, and I believe there's like support too. So you want to have like different types on your team. So let's head over here to the play option, and uh, let's go check it out. Here we go. Looks like it reminds me a lot of AA's Lobby. I'm not going to lie. I kind of think it looks better than AA's Lobby. But uh, that's open to interpretation there. All right, here we go. Let's do uh, infinite mode. Okay, so it looks like we have to complete the first story first. So let's head over to the first story. So Fairy City. All right, looks like there's six stages. 150 gems. That's a pretty good reward. Let's get into it. All right, so looks like there is two times speed. 1.5x speed? Okay, it's a start. It's a start. All right, I'll take it. There is autoplay, I think, as well, if you're a bad player. So it looks like it's like a JRPG-style game. So double tap the attack unit. Okay, that looks pretty cool. It looks like some decent animation. All right, so double tap. AoE single. Huh. Okay, so all my units have no AoE. So they're just, like, absolutely wrecking. Oh, my gosh. It looks like um, uh, Tanjiro is really weak, but he has... Oh, wow. Dang, Sanji has 200 health? What the heck? So I think he's he's weak because he's a, he's a defender. But yeah, it looks like my Sanji is just way, way better. Look at that guy. than anybody else. Oh, my gosh. It looks like there's five waves in the story. And it looks like they keep their HP. Okay, here we go. So some of them are really easy. All right, like, like this, this wave looks like it's really short. Okay. And uh, if you guys want to, there is autoplay as well. If you're just trying to do like a macro or something, it seems. So let's try the autoplay. Oh, you have to reach level 10 to unlock autoplay. So it looks like we're just absolutely destroying right now. So I'm going to speed up. Oh, the boss hits first. All right, he didn't do much damage though to my Sanji, it seems. So let's go slap this boss. 40 HP. I'm just going to have everybody attack. Oh, it looks like there is multiple options to attack depending on your unit. So we'll check that out too. Okay, and then I guess these lightning wizards are gonna slap us. So now they're first in the turn. Oh, okay. Okay, so this is this updates every time somebody attacks. So you can see who's going next. All right, he's a single target, so I'm gonna attack him. All right, Tondro's next. Hopefully this will kill him. Yeah. And then Kirito should be easy. Two HP, dang. 
But I believe he has a oh they're both AoE attack. All right, let's try it out. Okay, they're both single AoE attack. Interesting. Ice was at a zero HP and he's still alive. What the heck? Okay. All right, there we go. I think we just beat the first map. Let's go. All right, I'm gonna go beat the next map now. All right, Natsu is the next boss. So, uh, ooh, only six damage. Dang. All right, let's have everybody smack the boss. I want to see, um, but I want to see the boss is gonna do a lot of damage or something cool. All right, let's uh take him out. Oh my gosh, he still has 13 HP. All right, I'm gonna let the boss attack. Not because I have to, but um, uh, ooh, dang, he just completely nuked him. Oh my gosh, and now he looks like he's burned. So, okay, it tells you exactly what he does. So he takes a little bit of damage. But uh, all right, let's just go take him out. I think, I don't know if they have elements or something, because it looks like that guy did extra damage compared to my other units. But I think they all have like different types. But I'm not 100% sure. I'm not sure if it's based off of the strength agility type or if it's based off something else. Okay, because this guy was ice or water, it looked like he uh, nuked the fire guy instantly, which is pretty sweet. All right, let's go. Oh, 350 for that one. What? Why do we get so many? All right, let's try that. Let's do the next one. Maybe this one's gonna give us even more. All right, so if the unit is super effective against it, kind of like Pokemon, um, uh, it's gonna have the green arrow. So if you see the green arrow, that usually means it's a decent move. If you see a red arrow, that means it's resistant. So keep that in mind. So it looks like we got Natsu and Metal Mage now. Um, this is gonna be fun. All right, let's see who he's super effective against. So it looks like he's super effective against Lightning Wizard and none of the bosses. So uh, I'm just gonna have him slap Lightning Wizard, I guess for now. And we have Sanji who is not effective against either of the bosses, but it looks like he will, uh, inst okay. Looks like he's probably best against the boss. I don't know if the bosses have a type. Um, not sure. They might. I feel like Natsu's fire, so maybe my gray is gonna do be super effective against Natsu. And Metal Mage, I'm not sure what he is. Looks like all of them attack then. Okay, so let's see here. Okay, yeah, looks like he is super effective against Natsu because of the typing. Alright, and it looks like none of my guys are super effective against the mage. So I'm just gonna have him take out the Oh wait, he's not even gonna take out the wizard, dang. Oh my gosh, I guess I'll have him hit the boss because that boss looks kind of tanky. All right, let's go slap him. Then we got uh, Sanji. All right, I'm just gonna have Sanji hit the main boss because <laughs> I feel like the boss is gonna be doing the most damage. These lightning wizards are pretty weak. My Kirito is almost dead though. He's getting completely slapped, but he only did four damage. So I'm not too worried about that, but it looks like he got a debuff as well. All right, okay. So he actually is super effective against the boss for some reason. So I guess my freaking gray carries. Jeez. I didn't realize they're both fire bosses. All right, that should be easy GG's then. All right, let's see if we get 350 again or if we get 150. 350, dang, let's go. All right, we'll do one more and then let's go spin in the banner again. Cause it looks like the epics are way better than the rares. So another strategy is you wanna kill units that are higher up in the turn order so they never get a turn. That's another strategy I like to use. So I can see this ice wizard is next, but the ice wizard is dead, so we don't have to worry about it. So we'll just go insta kill the freaking fire wizard with my gray. Jeez, he's busted. And so now it's my turn again. So I think this fire wizard is going next now, unfortunately. So he will get to attack. But uh, you guys kind of get the gist. So let's go skip ahead to the boss again. All right, here we go. Now we're on the boss. So it looks like there's no like mana or anything. So it looks like you can always use the attack. That might be different for later units, but here we go. So we got to face Gray again. So uh, he's super effective against Gray. Uh, no, normal effective against these guys. So I'm just going to have him attack Gray. I know or my Gray is super effective against Natsu. So somebody's about to get nuked. Oh my gosh, that's quite a bit of damage there. All right, so, oh, I did not mean to click that, but eh, it's not a bad move. Um, all right, so it looks like Natsu's next. And he just... Oh my gosh, he just blasted my poor Sanji. Oh my, that's that's terrible. All right, well. Okay, so great. Oh my, look at that. Dang, half HP, not bad. All right, let's see here. That's not gonna do much, not gonna do much. Okay, looks like he's best against these ice wizards. I'm not sure what element he is. Is he fire? I guess that kind of makes sense for Tanjiro. 
Not really sure though. Um, okay, that's good on there. All right, I'm gonna take out this ice wizard. That way he doesn't get to attack. Yeah. Okay, my Sanji's almost dead. That's no good. All right, I'm gonna have him take out Gray then. Oh, I should have him take out Natsu because Gray's not attacking for a hot minute. What am I doing? Oh well. But I know. Oh, it looks like Natsu buffed the ice wizard. Interesting. Okay, so Gray's next though, so we'll just pop him. What the heck? He has zero HP, bro. I hate when that happens. They they often get stuck on like 0 0.1 HP or something. It's so weird. All right, that should be GG's. All right, 350. Let's head back to the lobby. Let's check it out, man. All right, back to Burst City. Again, great graphics here. All right, let's head over to the summon again. And let's see if we can get um uh, Cursed Sin. Here we go. Alright, we got ooh, I see a purple. I think it's a good sign. Oh, another Sanji. Another Sanji. Bro, how do we get two Sanjis, bro? Oh my gosh. Can we equip multiples of the same unit? I have not checked that out yet. Let's see if we can. I'm gonna go blow the rest of my gems though. So blue means I think we got a yeah, we got a rare. So blue is not a good color to get. All right, two more chances. Nope. And last chance. We got. Let's see here. Come on, something good. And we got Killua. Dang. Well, apparently there's also a way to awaken our units, which I would like to check out. Oh, there's traits as well. So let's check out traits and awaken. So trait wise, we got. Here. I'm gonna get a trade. Oh, okay, so it looks like they do level up. I'm gonna get a trade on Sanji. Okay, so it looks like you need two to roll on Sanji. He's a two star. Um, speed. The best one is 200% damage and 50% health. Dang. Dang. That's really cool. So there's like, that's a 1% chance you get something amazing. But even these Furiouses are pretty good. Lightning is pretty good. So there's a lot of good um, uh, traits, it seems. All right, that's a W. All right, let's head over to Awaken now. All right. So I think this is Evolution. So none of my units currently evolve, unfortunately. I don't think you can talk to these guys quite yet. So there you go. There's the game, guys. I'll have the Discord and the game link down below. The game drops on Saturday, which should be tomorrow for most of you. Or if you're watching this video later, it drops today. Catch you guys in the next one. Peace out.